The olden youth often tells us that it's all bollocks and balls, and uh, I think that though he uh, rarely receives a response from everyone, those who hear those words are uh, at once uh, taken aback and delighted, as am I. I hardly am taken aback. I find the concept of bollocks and balls are delightful, although I don't have an idea what a bollock is. I can imagine what a ball is. And maybe someday we'll be enlightened by the olden youth, but the uh, concept of uh, profanity and por por pornography, that the, uh, the, 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 um, the darker side, the sometimes called unwholesome side, really is a, a contrast in, in reality, because what is sexual is, is what gives us everything in terms of organic life. Yes, without the in term, unless you're talking about uh, a life that is is, is created or, or cre creates itself without sex, and there's lots of life that does that. But even then, there's 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 there's, there's the there's, there's the splitting of one and the becoming of another. It's all uh, bollocks and balls in the end. And I uh, I love I love hearing those words and pondering after their meaning. Bollocks and balls.